Okay. Hello guys, how's it going, Matchy House, and welcome back to the channel. And yes, I've made you wait long enough, but we are finally here. <laughs> we are going to play Red Dead Redemption 2. This is my very first time playing this. I have never played it. So yes, this is the ultimate edition, just to get let you guys know. So yeah. I know a few of you guys have been asking for me to play this, but um, yes, I did say to you guys that uh, I wasn't really a fan of the whole Western genre, but you swayed me, you swayed me. So, without further delay, let's get to it. Loading screen. Wow, wow, wow. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. America was becoming a land of laws. What? Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar Games presents... Red Dead Redemption 2. Red Dead Redemption, aye, aye. Oh, he looked cold. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know. An old man in town. Bandit. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Chapter One, Coulter. Bring 
Quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There he yeah, is. he looked a bit dead. More you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it. Gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We are all I need. All right. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey. I ain't had time to ask. But what really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Uh, we need you strong. Okay. All right. Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Yeah. It has to blow over soon, boy. Second settings. Uh, <laughs> Let 
General. Well, I'm assuming those are on. Nah. Okay. I can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. Oh, do Kazim. We need to get those people warm. Made you wait long enough. <laughs> you don't need to worry about Pinkerton's in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Why not? Wait, is that someone coming towards us? You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Oh, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. Not doing too bad, my friend. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them down to is. Or was. Yeah. And Mac and John, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? I hope so. I really do hope so. Because I, I have said to you guys in the past that I'm not really a big fan of the whole western genre, but give it a chance. my friend. How much further? I appreciate Not it. Far. <clears throat> mm. uh, yeah, this is the uh, ultimate edition, just so you guys know. Got it on the sale a few months back. 20 odd quid I think it was because I weren't paying full price for it because they're still charging 90 quid for it
Okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Come with yours on disc. Yeah, this is just okay. the uh, download. Let's head down there. Health is displayed. Okay. Health pass shows your main health level in the call. And for example, your health through films. Okay. Let's hitch up here. Spook these fine people. <laughs> Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Hmm. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. Oh, shit. You know, I, I just Arthur, some There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you just... Gentlemen. Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go. Be now, friend. I Window. Ah, oh, shit. I'll do, Lewis. I do apologize. I was concentrating on the aiming. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Driscoll boys here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Keeps freezing. It's weird. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. O'Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. 
There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big oh, sure, as to be honest. Yours. Seems all right. is dry and warm we could maybe move the women and jack down here maybe we'll see how they are when we get back i don't really want us to split up uh, looks like the poor bastard was married too at some point if we can't eat it or drink it put it down <laughs> fair enough salted meat Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. Take everything. Hmm. It seems to be um, all right on my end. <clears throat> Ooh, two dollars thirteen. Medicine, take everything. Canned fruit, biscuits. Gotta have some biscuits. Can we go? I'm searching for shit. Still looking, Dutch. Leave me alone. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur. Go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we missed. Sure. That's the guy in the barn. Oh shit. What the ninja? This guy just jumped me. Oh, oh, did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Como Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. 
Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. And please. And please. Sorry. Where's my hat? Continue to bone your horse. Ah, okay. Is that bastard still in there? He's dealt with. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. Where? Here? Okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I. He. He was my husband. So he was the husband in the cart. Hey! Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh. We found PC only, how dare they? But there is more about, apparently. Scouting a train. <clears throat> That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's going to be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? 
Get yourself to bed. Blind. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Uh, Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank you this way lest I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave I like that uh, wouldn't be the first time Yeah, probably not. If there ever was a third one, it'd probably be on the next console. Because it'll be too focused on GTA. Or GTA Online, mostly. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well... Seems somebody left <clears throat> recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Here's some tracks leading to the river. Yeah. Nah, they've never got enough See, money. John, you tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Okay. Watch out for this crevice. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> we continue along the cliff wall here. Davy got shot. Mac and John both shot, too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Oh. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. We well, better hurry up then, boy. I was looking up regarding PlayStation earlier, regarding no, considering they've got a fair bit of billions left. People reckon it could be either Rockstar that they might buy, or Konami. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, 
people reckon more to Rockstar, you know, regarding this, um, this whole Microsoft acquisition. Basically saying if you take away Call of Duty off PlayStation, then we'll take Rockstar Games off <laughs> the Xbox. Just like I calls I've been looking up to the aim. But we shall see, I suppose. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Okay. That horse is poo. Giant. Down. Down this way. I think they have, like, I think the deadline is sometime this week, isn't it? Now, come on. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're coming, John. Damn, it's cold. Well, it will be. Because you're on Paramount Mountain. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John! Marston, you hear me? John! John! Come here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! Down here. 
down here. All right. Hot down, Marston. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but mm. good to see you, Arthur Morgan. I know, but not much we can do about it, really, is there? I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. He looks familiar. Is that the main guy from the first game? Go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Fire sure looks similar. You all right? I think so. Come on. He wants Hopefully to do a protest. <laughs> Won't do much anyway. Oh shit. You see that on the ridge? Parf. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. Where did they go? I know, I know. I mean, Call of Duty has been um, Let's go, getting a bit boring now, isn't it? I mean, it has overstayed its welcome. I mean, I suppose it wouldn't be too bad if it was like every few years, but they release one every fucking year. It's like, Jesus. Happen now, is it? <laughs> so say with Assassin's Creed, they come out every year. But I am curious to see what the um, Assassin's Creed Red is going to be like. Considering that's all set in Japan, and you know me, I do like games that are like based in Japan, you know, like Ghost of Tsushima and stuff. And apparently, it's, it's supposed to go to like full-blown stealth and stuff. Get some 
some help here. And they are fucked off. Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. There we go. There we go. Ah, he's careful. It's your task. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. Still remember what Activision did to cop with the Model 1 for 2 on the desk. And oh, I know. a tiny Wasting bit of megabyte. Worse. Come on, <laughs> Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Moggy. A premium version. Yeah, it won't surprise me. Wouldn't surprise me. Trophy. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Captain's log. DLC, is that what I call it? We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. <laughs> Stick it. God damn, it's cold. Come with you boys because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the land, you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you. Cool. Shut up, Michael. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> no, but you better not. <laughs> better not be. Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> and it probably is like going to be the last time we see it, um, <clears throat> Silas. You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching. Our Lance Reddick. Want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. 
I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. Oh, do Jason. Then revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Colm always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please go <laughs> to the place there are O'Driscoll's about? Yeah! I won't. I won't. Don't worry. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet. Okay. Out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. Oh, that's original, isn't it? <laughs> See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Gentlemen, this is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. Okay, Jan A. That's definitely them. Home? I think, I think so. Yeah, that's him. Who 
Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oh. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. <laughs> Come on, let's get down there. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. You got it, Dutch. Good. Come on, let's go. We'll circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, <laughs> Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Oh yeah. No surprise there, considering the state of my vote at the minute. Wonder what Zack Snyder has in store. She probably got sick and tired of being rushed. I mean, look at bloody Mordok in Ant Man. Jesus Christ, that was horrendous. I thought Doctor Strange's eye there at the end the multiverse of madness was this. bad. They're gonna be gunning for you. <clears throat> they got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Down through these trees, quick. Surprise me at all. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. So we got everything we need. Yep. Okay, fine. You make the move.
can't tell who's who. Suck my cock. Get what we need, clear out. We're waiting on you, R3. 
Thank you. Arthur, get over here. Get over here. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Chewing tobacco? Yes, please. Looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. <coughs> A Mr. Spider-Man 2 Wolverine will have new dialogue technologies. That's a new one. No bad boys for life, outlaws for life. Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Won't happen again, boy. I'll do bad. Still getting used to it at the minute. <laughs> it's the whole, it's the whole stamina situation and stuff like that. It's still getting used to the uh, controls and stuff. But yeah, it's pretty good so far. But yeah, I, I, I knew you'd be chuffed with this. Catch you waiting long enough. Two, eight, 
Gonna do it the first time. Stay back. <laughs> uh. You're coming with me. Mm. on Westerns, but there's no only the gems name. that deserve accepting photos. Duffy, Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please. Anal. <laughs> Ah, you're right. I hardly know him. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will <laughs> shut it for you. <laughs> better shut your mouth, you little shit. On, just name your price. Just let me go, please. They don't tell me nothing. I swear. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one. Oh, wow, that man, no. Damn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Lit. Hey, but he's feeling sick right now. Gore Simulator. Here we are, you sack of shit. <laughs> Introduce you to the boys. The boys? Don't hurt me, please. No, oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Mm -hmm. huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle! Yeah, I did recognize the character from earlier. Um, I did 
ask if it was the main guy from the first game and said yeah but regarding red dead one it's a bit of a shame considering it's a ps3 game because you can't stream ps3 games i can't believe it I know Driscoll in my camp. You have to stream in order to play PS3 games, unfortunately. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Seven hours later. Mission complete. And uh, I bet they can do it. I bet they know how to do it. Just like they are doing with the uh, classics catalogue. I bet they know how to do it, they just can't be asked. Um, <coughs> Yo. We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. Speak to the manager. We're okay. <laughs> we have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. In the Navy. Standed at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies. By choking on semen. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. Can you imagine going to Eastwood? <laughs> if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. I'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Well, I was watching the news earlier, and they showed um, like an update video regarding Bruce Willis, you no, know, like celebrating his birthday, which I thought was nice. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look at this game in those hands. I'll find it, and you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. I'm alone, boy. Here, you take this. I can't <gasps> use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. The last of us. Gone. And we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. <laughs> Come on, this way. in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. Uh. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? To well, it put me off Micah earlier, near the start, with sure. the, um... Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. When no, he was teasing that bit, woman. Oh, it could be a bad one. A bit of skirt. Been a wild few days, all right. That right north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good.
Ah, right, really. <laughs> well, we shall see. We shall see. Oh, dead eye, the motherfucker. <laughs> Okay. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh. Stay quiet. We should have then. <laughs> hey, stop here a second. I see something. Yeah, they always start off like that, don't they? Slow pace at the start. Okay. There's deer been here recently. How can you tell? Ah, uh, good boy. Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. One one. Okay. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. Uh, so you're right, so it does look visually stunning. I don't think so. Maybe not. Focus. The bears. Way okay. Give me two. <sighs> Hello. Wait, look. There they are. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. Try to get him in. Nice. See if you can get another one. Okay. Is there another one? Oh, I see. No, that didn't kill it. You should go finish it off.
Aïe, aïe, aïe. Fuck. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. Let's go. Attention to detail in the physics, though. Hello. Yeah, bond with your horse before he gets killed. <laughs> Not bad, boy. 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 Finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. This is America. America, fuck yeah. Sorry. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. Oh, watch it. We've only been up here a few days, and we've already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Mm. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the old Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. Mm -hmm. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well... We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Watch out. Bear up ahead. 
Shit. Let's see if we can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. We'll meet again, bear. Cut up here, off the trail. Six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. <laughs> what? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. Oh, no Even no. the weather effects were amazing. You can see it all you getting all fogged home, up. No I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. I was wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. Mm. You still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. But for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. Or never. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. You know. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. Tell me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't yeah. take nobody but him. You don't choose the horse, the horse chooses you. Honey, we're home. Whoa! I'm gonna hit time over here. Brought some food back, boys. <sighs> Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, mm. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. There's a lifetime of practice to master. There we go. Well, well, well. <sighs> Just drop it. What a surprise. Find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to mm. greet an old friend? 
feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Ah, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. <laughs> no, it isn't. Now, shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. <laughs> Jesus, what is that? Maybe rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you saying it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. <laughs> you go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. <laughs> Skin you? <coughs> yeah. You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skinned that one, did you? Dumped on the floor there. Okay. Let's skin. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, fucking hell. <laughs> Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Well, that is attention to detail. Yeah, we said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> a few days later. Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans. <clears throat> Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Yeah, I don't think I don't think that future rock star again is gonna be the same. Other passion. Considering one of the houses is left now, isn't it? You're still here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. <laughs> I think it's time for the train. You want me to go? Well, of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. <laughs> What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rock <clears throat> man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill, is it is John the same voice? The water tower. By the way, I just thought just ask him. Problem. Why are we doing this? Oh, is it a different Let's voice? Uh, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. Come on. What do you want from <clears throat> Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. <coughs> you fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly, we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! <laughs> Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Hey, this should be fun. Just follow the damn train, CJ. <laughs> One of three deer skinned, okay. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscoll, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to take it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. 
There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars to deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Ray, have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. <laughs> you worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. No. Come on. Let's run. Roll out. the detail man <laughs> sorry I'm just admiring the view <laughs> I do have one question though regarding this game can you like fast travel I hope so, because it'll be a lot of um, riding and running about. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me or does it look as though the snow is melting. Stairs, coaches and trains are everywhere. Right, okay. Is Bill there? Yeah. You head down good, 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 good. He's on? Okay. I'm assuming I need money to do that though. <laughs> Check on Bill. Okay, do I go down? God damn it. I pay for fast travel. <laughs> Billy boy. Pick up. <laughs> My eyes must be playing trucks on me because it does look like the snow's melting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 
This is good. All right. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. No mistakes, boy. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Go on, sell me. Sell me. What I want a weapon wheel. Switch items on wheel. Cycle mask. Okay. Choo choo! It's Thomas the Tank Engine. Gentlemen, it's time. It's time, boy. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Follow the damn train, CJ! Shit. Remember, uh, uh, can you? Jesus. Here we go, here we go. Oh, fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing. Right. Yeah, I'm good. What the hell is Bill doing? He had long enough to set that song. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. We gotta hurry. We have to stop this train. That's what we're doing, kid. I got these sons of bitches. Boom. Oh. I'm looting. Shoot him, damn it. <laughs> Fuck it out. Can do a roll with this couple of shots. Yeah, explode. Nice. Oh shit, here we go.
смотри. Черт. Oh shit! God damn it! I wonder what happened there. Shit! More guards coming out of that train car. There better be some money at the end of this. All these bastards must be guards. Oh fuck's sake! Come away. Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Oh, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? <coughs> Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. You got no way in here. Wake up. 
Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. <laughs> now, it doesn't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now, like the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. March 21st. Happy birthday right, to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, real Kratos. Happy birthday to you. Look at this place. It's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the shape? Very swish. Should be easy as cake. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay. Take all the shit, man. Get this open. Very welcome, Kersey. Fine brandy. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. Give me those. Why can't I carry more than one cigar? Invoices, blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. No, sugar imports from the so. Spanish West Indies? A lot of sugar? Some fancy new boaties ordered from Europe? <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> <sighs> Let me search them more. Thanks. That's thirty two dollars. Are you done in there? Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> what did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. James Bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us, okay? See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. Okay, get on the train, quick, all of you. Any bright ideas, I kill all three of you. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. Go on. If I hear so much as a footstep from this car, you'll end up like all your friends out here. I am blue. Stop running, stop running. Jesus. Continue your touch to put fire bars. The bad guy is here to stop him. Let me, let me, let me. And 
fancy harp there, though. We hang on. Kaka. Right, right, bang. My guy just slams them back on the floor. Choo choo. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <laughs> Now that is a stunning shot right there. Copyrights, probably. <laughs> Excuse me. Lenny! Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make <clears throat> sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a This no indeed it did. Indeed it did. On the road again. Get us out the street. I'm trying. Gotta keep us moving, but come. Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, <laughs> let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Sure, I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick 
Third time's a charm. Yeah, we go. See, every time, third time. <laughs> See, you ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Oh shit. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, ah. we wouldn't have seen them. We lost them, Eakins. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Roger Clark oh, for his nose. Oh, she made Well, get in. I'll tell you. Okay. It's just strange if it right outside. Span. Span. Compass. Regular. Long yes. Yeah, might as well leave it on. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. Nice to see my boys. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Being friends and all that oh, jazz. Maybe it's not. Subbing to each other. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more. The hatchet gang, oh yes. Bit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. The boys are hatchets, girls are hatchets. <laughs> Just because it sounds fancy, don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? <clears throat> I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. <laughs> My father was a colored man. Uh, across the bridge. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our land... It's like the bridge from Derry in I It. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A little a squirrel, though. You never <laughs> did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. If only the GTA Definitive Trilogy was like, you know, like this, with the draw distance and stuff like that. No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. Well, at least I still got the original trilogy on me, um, library, so... Boys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of you are now heartless, you shall buy flashes when I can. Well, you're too hard to kill. Let's okay. hope not. And this Make sure you gold. wear clothes appropriate for me. Oh. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. T shirt and shorts. It'll do for now. <clears throat> How low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but. We kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. Just look at the draw distance, sir, man. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. And the bay can explore all the way over, yeah. 
they're still here, so I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Spiritual cores used in cooking. Why two parts can be fine to have all pet lamps or land bound their properties. Okay. It's a lot of information to take in. For me anyway. <laughs> With my um tuberous sclerosis, it takes me a bit longer to get information in my brain. To understand shit now. Oh, I see some smoke over there. I would gallop, but um, I'll probably just end up wrecking the wagon again. <laughs> Plus, I'm just enjoying the view. Yeah, uh, wrong way. <laughs> See, I'm doing John the View too much. I'm <laughs> going the wrong way. <laughs> but yeah, for the PS4 game, this has to be the best looking PS4 game. Hands down. Mm, an adaptation. If they were going to do that, I think they should do it like um, a series. Because I don't think they'll be able to um, do it in like a film. It would definitely have to be a series. But having said that, in today's world, they'll probably walk the shit out of it. Instead of it being a, f a fella as the main character, you'll be an empowered woman and all that jazz. Hey, easy. There you are, brother. Head in there. You follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. And if you okay, don't like it, you're a misogynist, indeed. And I've gone the wrong way again, haven't I? Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Watch this now, by the time I've finished playing this, another full game, they'll, they'll probably announce a fucking remaster, <laughs> knowing my luck.
Here is perfect. Are. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. Kept us alive, boy. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from our dreams. It's got a notification saying the last of us part three and Red Dead Redemption or three are in the same boat. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be Let's west have a look. of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. Share controversy. Oh, the KKK. Would you just look around you? Let's right, have a look. This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. Up for Robin Banks, Two titles are on a uniquely comparable scale when it comes somehow. to the potential size of them now, and the fan reception everyone, they would receive. Because of this, both games can be said to be in the same boat, with both sharing an or overt amount of similarities safe. within now, their current uncertainty. So it is time for everyone to get mm. to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what. If you want to look it up, it's on a Uncle Game Rants website. No more passengers. <laughs> it is time mm. for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town. All Mind you, have to make a PS5 version, you have to buy it again. That seems a decent place to Imagine. Start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. If that would happen, I reckon they should do what they did with um, Grand Theft Auto. Gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Not like a pay upgrade thing. Ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I was thinking Grand Theft Auto 5, it was a tenor, wasn't it? Something like that. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my For a limited time. Not me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. <laughs> Chapter 2 Trophy A couple of weeks later we Got off the mountain and Rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I need to shave. Once more, I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. In spite of black water and that whole mess. Characters start coming to me. Taking the piss. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm going to read a book. <laughs> Beginning to look like Joel. <coughs> Excuse me. That's my tent. Examine.
Well, hmm. Considering with what happened with um, Assassin's Creed, look what happened to that film. It was a bloody flop. Sleep. Let's have a shave, boy. I saw you as the first person for a lot of this shooting. It's not more like Yeah. Okay. Piece of my next two. Change clothes, what clothes do I have? So that's what I've got now. And, Metal Gear game adaptation. Well, apparently that's still in thing, isn't it? Um, development hell. Slightly more pale with more light range protection from the core. Two, one, one, two. You need enough. Yeah, apparently, uh, with the Metal Gear, it was supposed to star. I forget his name. He was it. He was the main guy who did. Um, is it called Moon Knight? The um, Marvel series. Animal hunting is great to cross their skins and crawling. Oh, cool. Well, like that. Shirts. Oscar Isaac, that's the one. That's a bit bright. Pants. James. No, not Arthur. Also, a couple of morons trading the lynch. So, I ran away, came back, tried again. Suspenders.
Yeah, apparently, yeah, he's supposed to be playing the role of Snake, but I did see a little clip. Um, it was quite a while back. He was being interviewed and he was asked about it and he couldn't really give much apart from it's still in, like, development hell. <clears throat> you have no outfit suitable for cold weather on your horse. Okay. Well, we'll just have to wait and see. Bloodborne, now that'd be sweet. Are you diddling? Why are you looking at me like that? Pearson! I'm famished! What do you need? It's coming, it's coming. Nothing, just looking at you. All up on me right now. Contribute. Give item. Give me. She wants a tickle. How are you, Abigail? Donate. <clears throat> uh, do. King Gong. It's like your own little hobo, yeah. my crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. I'm very okay. happy to make you something if you bring me the right materials. Hogwarts Legacy. Oh, that would be cool. Excuse me, I don't think I have anything here. I reckon I'm gonna think about it. Could really use some good meat for this stew. HBO. Don't you overcook this now, Pearson. This all I got for you. Thank you, Arthur. Morning, Mr. Morgan. Morning, sir. How is that food coming along, Mr. Pearson? It'll be ready when it's ready. 
<laughs> Fair enough. Arthur. Yo. Davy. You're Arthur, right? My name ain't no concern of yours. I'm hungry. I don't give a damn. <clears throat> Look, you, you seem like a decent feller behind it all. Then you ain't a good judge of character. <laughs> oh, well, we'll leave it there then. <laughs> Nom, 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 nom. Oh, that looks nice. Oh, that does look nice. Nom, nom. If I eat too much, do I peek? my friend just name the place <laughs> no I would not play a WWE game sorry to disappoint you you know I'm more into story driven games guys Yes, please. Mr. Pearson. Do you want it cooked right or not? Oh, what does that take? Hey. Hey. Imagine you can actually play this in VR. That would be pretty cool. Uh, who should I go to first? The U, the R, S, or hey. Oh. Good morning. Good morning. Bloodborne in VR, jeez. That'll be a challenge. <laughs> I have actually thought about that, you know. Because there are a couple of games, isn't there? <clears throat> Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Yeah, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Sure. I got some errands to run. Kill count. Yeah, I got a couple. The horses are ready. I did get a couple. You gonna take the old man into town? You can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored. Well, yeah, there's there's Battle for Bikini Bottom in there, and there's that Harry's new one that's just come out. Grimshaw. Cosmic Shake, I think it's called. Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <laughs> <laughs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? 
three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin, and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Sorry to break you too, but I find those games crap. <laughs> Had to best clean off at times. Ooh. Only fans, seven dollars. Should be the fan, the only fans theme tune. back from over there, could you? Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. When this drops an October bit and hang around. The best money glitches. No, I bet it didn't. Got yeah, it comes out tomorrow. Bag. Um, where is it? I'll be, uh... Streaming that tomorrow. Sorry, 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 sorry. <clears throat> it's a separate game, I believe. Uh, I think it came out on the PSP as well as the PS2, but I think the one that they're putting on the store is the PSP version. 
for a gentleman, sir. <clears throat> a gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. supposed to me it means you got a heart a small one perhaps hidden deep inside but a real one and you haven't your pulse vote lizard lizards have <laughs> hearts well arthur i'm proud of you to be honest if you lot hadn't been here i probably would have robbed him <laughs> <laughs> well you did it <laughs> Excuse me. Horse riding kind of gets Metal Gear vibes. <laughs> Your horse is out of wrestling lands out. Let's get closer. Okay. <laughs> Very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people. Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh no. <coughs> Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. <laughs> okay. Take a good look around, ladies. See what we got here. Do be do 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 do. do. I'm drunk as a skunk. I'm as drunk as a skunk. It's here, down the main street. Chairs always on the right. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. <laughs> Let's park up down the end there, near the stable. Just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self respecting maniac does put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You Days, are especially that month. Man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. <laughs> You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, <laughs> then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Mommy, sunshine. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. You not getting anything, Arthur? 
Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Bait beans. We need some bait beans. Ground coffee. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See that? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? A lamb or a sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. Well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. The price is on. <laughs> Look at this. A jaw harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god awful time in the mountains. Jack Daniels. Kindly. Ah, this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do it. Let's go wait for them outside. Candy. No, it's expensive, isn't it? Cheese, I want to buy some cheese. I like my cheese. Absolutely. It's a funny world. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Yeah. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. And that's your red dress. Yeah, yeah, it's right out there, New Indeed. Right, it's real quiet out there. <clears throat> Sounds good. Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was going to rob. Why? <laughs> Seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Mm. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Oh Excuse shit. Me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get off of me! I've been looking. Get your hands off of her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey, hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. <laughs> Go away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her! I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. From what I can tell, Miss Garnett's back selling her behind me. God damn it. I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather, mid twenties, blonde. You're feeding people. <laughs> yeah, <very laughs> seriously. Are you uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. No trouble now, please. I'll try not to. Friend of hers. 
Get out of here, buddy. I paid. They paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here. I paid for nothing. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him? <coughs> Not very well. You okay? Fine. Ow, got sure. a bruise. Yeah. <laughs> nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just me. Ray Trace. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know. <laughs> banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. I hope uh, everything's okay up there. After you. Excuse me. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. We're here for each other. Hey, that's my horse. Just borrowing it. Get. Get back here right now. Where's he going? Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. I made a mistake. I'm sorry. <laughs> <sighs> Come on then. I'm too kind. <laughs> you okay, partner? No. No, I am not. <clears throat> I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Give me Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Yeah. Oh. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see... I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? <laughs> I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding? Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. <laughs> not, not one lick. Not one sense in this year old mind. Come on. 
come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Give me plant. Well, Charlie, please. Eat it. Nom nom. That's a girl. Yep. Mwah, mwah, mwah. How's the game going? It's going very good, Jason. Just get the hell back where you came from. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. You will be answering to the law if this carries on. Here's what the hell did I ever do to you? What? God damn it. God, people so easily offended. Warps, time and how in the supply on started got about. Ah, okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Hello. Now that ain't right. I'm guessing he's in here.
<laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Hello. Why are you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? <laughs> Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. <laughs> well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Thank you. About to kiss that guy Take or punch him. Huh? Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> 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 oh shit. Oh. Get him. Oh. Stop, stop. Please, please, I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Uh, excuse me. The mud detail. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. <laughs> Look who we found sniffing about. Joe Zatrelloni. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. <laughs> ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, 
Always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah. Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. <laughs> now, where do I go to take a bath? It's, uh, you. Yes, it is. Last time I checked. I, I really don't need any more trouble. I didn't come to make any. I was just protecting a lady. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. So what is it you need? A, a bath, perhaps? Yes, now we're we'll go upstairs. I get off for first scrub scrub do I? Stairs, isn't it? Moaning and groaning. <clears throat> Would you like some extra help there? <sighs> oh, yeah. Ah, I can do up enough. <laughs> oh, there it is. Thought he said fifty dollars, but fucking man. Good. Now don't you worry about a thing. <laughs> I'll be out of your hair in no time. Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. I do not like getting older. You're telling me. <laughs> Some parts of me probably ain't been this clean in months. Let's just keep that between us and these four walls, shall we? <laughs> 
You might be the friendliest person I've met in this town. Yes, that's how it is around here. Always been. So, what do you do when you're not working? Let's see, there isn't much to do here except count the stars, you know? All right, I think I'm good. It was nice getting to know you. <laughs> Need to go and get my hat. Good evening, friend. Bye. Queasy feeling you've been having? Think that's because there's so many O'Driscolls about. You got the look of a pleader. You a pleader, friend. All right, okay. Shall have to keep an eye out for that. is still following me. Choo-choo!
Let's go, boy. Hey, get that okay, horse out of okay. here! Okay, keep your hair off. Yep. Jose? You wanna go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. Mm. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but... Ain't no boat to see. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you can buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best one. Oh, well, I guess you're right. Die. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. Easy, big feller. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. <laughs> I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. We'll be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stable. Some beautiful saddles. This is now your man nice horse. Yeah, what happened to that? Stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? <laughs> Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day, and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. 
Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. It's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. Bill and Phil. Yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Uh, so we'll not haptic. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Bear with me. Uh, settings. Controls. Vibrations on. No. Need to be done right. Have a couple of leads I'm looking into. There's no vibrations on when you ride it now. Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. She's boy. <clears throat> Stables are just up ahead. All right, go sell that big fruit. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Okay. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show sure, you. Yeah. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. Okay.
Agents say she lit the place up herself on account of her husband was cheating on her. Oh? Services. yourself a deal and a fine new horse i hope so well i don't sell anything other than good animals you have my word on that here are your papers and on me a new grooming brush and some treats <laughs> appreciate it yeah all right you you treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Looks like a nice animal you got there. You happy? Thank you. Guess we'll see. Bear with me. There's one to double chat ball for those around. Are you gonna mount that new horse of yours or not? <laughs> All right, let's get going. <clears throat> We've got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just I'll do a silent gamer. Here. Back into the mountains. Sure didn't figure on that. At this time, we're doing the chasing. Easy. So how are things with you and John? Uh, Me and John, fine. It about time you let go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's a code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Yeah, it's my first time it's playing this. Much After all these years. But it's done. Has yeah, I'm just playing the main game. Would have been welcomed back that easy after that long, and you know it. Maybe, but please don't you put that to the test. Uh, I never would. <clears throat> so pretty. I think my dad would have loved to uh, seen this game. Rest his soul. 
don't like the online. Fair enough. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Look at that milky way up there. I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. I appreciate it, gamer. Thank you. That's the lake there. Good. Damn. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Yeah, my dad liked westerns, like uh, John Wayne and stuff like that. So, uh... I should really be heading back over to Great Plains about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him? So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. We'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes, and obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> nice. <laughs> We should camp here. Sure. Now then, you get a set up. Uh, We're set up camp, boy. Uh, I'm famished. Look at that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. Craft. Some of this? 
No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. Those fire effects, though. He better be worth all this drama. <laughs> Seven hours later. Arthur. Good job, it don't you rain. Well, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? <laughs> sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track them, but we might need to lay bait to draw them out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous, but we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. Tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was... Actually weaned on bear meat. Just mix it together. Okay. It's not too hard. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Pack up, Arthur. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, Come boy. Come on, boy. Let's luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. Well, I was in this area <clears> with <throat> years ago. Really? Damn, look at that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Uh. Did you two ever think about getting out of the life? We did briefly. Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess you were still young. Didn't last need long. to figure out how to <laughs> control it. She knew what I was. Are you sure this is the right way? I just want to look at the view. Let's look at that. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. Jesus. <laughs> you know that. But Bessie and Definitely the best looking PS4 game. thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen. If Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? This looks even better than the PS5 version of GTA V. <laughs> GTA 6, wow. <laughs> Let's hope so. Eh? See if he's been fishing again recently. Okay, Jenny. Oh, look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. You have entered legendary animal territory. Here, Jose. Be 
sure look big enough. I'm surprised that screenshot's still up. <laughs> I can get in trouble. Anyone have put it up though? The tracks go into those trees. Go hunt Yogi Bear. Creepy music intensifies. Something else on the ground, just here. I'll take a look then. That shit. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. We lost him? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Uh, we'll use the bait because if we split up, no Let's doubt he'll bye, probably bye, die. Bye. <laughs> Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Mm hmm. A smart Morgan when nature calls. Alrighty then. Love those films. <clears throat> I see even the creases in his leather jacket and you see him moving. Satchel. Uh... Yeah. Pet detective. Now we wait. <laughs> Don't leave me. Wait for the bear. Thousand pounds, you say? More or less. Uh. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Oh, I should have got my rifle. <laughs> I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm... Fine. Never mind. <laughs> Try and take the fucker down with my revolver. Let's take a look at that bait. Sure. This was game of the year 2018. You only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. <laughs> we 
hand here. Got your knife? <sighs> oh, hello. Easy. No, it's too close. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. Thank you. I think. That was fun. <laughs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. Mm -hmm. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. A dragon? <laughs> Bigfoot? I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well. Uh... I'm gonna stick around here for a while. <laughs> Uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah. Okay. Gonna get ugly. Seem close. Excuse me, s'il vous plaît. Bear shit. Pick up my hat.
Oh. Excuse me. Hmm. <laughs> Jesus. God damn it. Indeed, both got fucked up. Supposed to come here. It's diving. It's all right, boy. They brush you. Okay, boy. Right. That bear ruined my leather jacket. So much blood. Oh, God. You got some medicine. Better than nothing. Damn it, that won't help. Look at me. I'm bleeding out of here. All right, Jesus. Can't. Can't. Stay. I can't fall. I get her. Okay. That's the thanks I get for trying to help you. Okay, boy. Fuck you.
God. <laughs> Such your next bears by pressing square. Okay. Um. Ah, nice little detail there. Turkey. <clears throat> yeah. The pouring of the uh, graphic. Ah, oh, right, okay. Have to bear that in mind. Damn, how far is this place? Yep.
Really? Sounds about right being rock star. Huge is smart, doesn't it? I'm I'm just admiring the views. <laughs> Goes the weasel. I didn't do nothing. James, James. What the fuck? Boy. P 
peace and peace and peace. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. Or do I need to donate it? You know these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, Skill Tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thanks, Pearson. Very good. We were getting low. Well done, Mr. Morgan. Who do I get this to? Hello, Mr. Morgan. Did all right skin that. I did. See you. Oh, only when I see you. I don't know who to give this to. Question now, then.
Isn't working. Live. Steak bowl. materials and I'll be glad to make something nice for you I think I need to get my hands on some materials first. You brought me in, help me. How about no? Herr Morgan, Herr Morgan. Mr. Strauss, you busy, my friend? <laughs> Why? I'll cut you in. Flown it. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guffrey Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal <coughs> work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. Individual on the gang money um, out on the map. Okay. Morgan. You seem chipper, but where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? We've been thinking about our problem all wrong. All wrong. That's all. Meaning? All in good time, my friend. All in good time. <laughs> Always the show, man. Give me all the money.
Hello, Arthur. Yeah. I'm guessing those are the ones I need to go to. Don't mean to do that. We <laughs> got to go to Mexico later on the story, but I should record some more show on that. There it is. <clears throat> right, I think this would be a good place to end part one if I'm being completely honest with you. Um, cheese. Okay, now. How do you save it now? Sorry. Save game. Yes, plays. But yeah, I think I'll leave it here, but yeah, I'm impressed. I'm definitely impressed. Definitely the best looking PS4 game anyway. But yeah, I'm glad that you've um, sweared me, Ben, for playing this. <laughs> I mean, just look at that. I mean, wow. But yeah, I can't wait to play more of this for you guys soon. Uh, tomorrow we will be streaming uh, the Siphon Filter Dark Mirror, considering I've only played the first three of the original trilogy, so there'll be another new game on the channel, which I've never played, so I'll be uh, looking forward to that one. So yeah. I do hope you have enjoyed the stream guys as always, so feel free to like, comment, share and subscribe, it helps me out. Be sure to give us a follow on the socials, and if you do want to help support the channel, click the join and hit the super thanks. So, yes, Red Dead Redemption 2, pretty awesome so far. So again, hope you enjoyed guys, Badge as, see you soon with a new video.